Hi everyone, this is Shukesh Banik from Gadgets Portal and today I am going to make the full in-depth review on this Nokia Lumia 620 which is a very good compact Windows Phone 8 mobile phone and the best thing about this device is that it has got very premium build quality and especially the back cover of this device is kinda strange. It feels very soft in hand and it is also dual tone. There is a thin layer of see-through plastic above the white color which is giving this a very soothing to the eyes look. Because of this unibody look, the back cover of this device is really very hard to remove. The display is a 3.8 inches clear black display and because of this compact size it is very easy to handle with one hand and the keys are of extremely good quality and very easy to handle. In fact, this device will be great for those people who have medium to small sized hands and beyond doubt this is also a very stylish device. The quality of the loudspeaker is good but when you are handling this phone with your left hand, you are actually covering it and I have also encountered problem while playing games. If you put this phone on a soft surface like on a bed or on a sofa, then you are not going to hear the ringtone. So you should be very careful. Now let's talk about the display on this device which is extremely good. It is a clear black display with WVGA resolution and it is also much better than the IPS display on Lumia 520. The colors are extremely vivid and it is also very bright and the pixels are very crisp. This is the best display you can get on a device under 20,000 rupees if you ignore the display size. Now let's look into the software on this device. Here are the notifications on the lock screen of this device which cannot be accessed from here like Android devices and hopefully in near future we will get this kind of features on a Windows phone. Now you must know these simple tricks like you can change the sound profile from here and the truth is the user interface on all the Windows Phone 8 devices are just the same. You can search from here and you can also directly launch the camera from your lock screen just by long pressing on the camera key. In fact there is a plus point of buying an entry level or mid range Windows Phone 8 device because you get the same user interface as Lumia 920 and you are also getting compass on this device unlike Lumia 520 so that you can get the premium softwares like Nokia CityLens etc and you are also getting premium services from Nokia like Nokia Music, Nokia Drive and also Nokia Maps. Now as you know if you get new message or new update you can get notifications on this respective tiles and also an instant notification here but there is no dedicated notification center which I don't like. You have to browse all the tiles on this home screen and search for notification but I have heard that Microsoft is working on a separate notification center. As you can see I have just got a new message and I can click here to read this otherwise it will go and you have to search for the messaging tile and you can also get an idea about the notifications on this device from the lock screen. Here are the applications on this device alphabetically sorted and you cannot rearrange them but you can obviously rearrange these tiles and as you know if you press and hold the back key you can get your previously running applications and these applications are in suspended mode which will save a lot of battery power on this device. Now if you single press on this back key, you will get just the previous application that was running on this device and you have to continuously press the back key to get rid of all the running applications on this device. So this is completely different from Android and you cannot end all the applications with one click. In fact, this Windows Phone 8 operating system is completely different from Android, iOS or Blackberry 10. I'll talk about this later. These are the alphabetically sorted apps and you can search for any one. But if you don't know the exact name of any application, for example any game, then it will be very hard for you to find that application unless you have put a tile of that app on the home screen. There is another thing I want to talk about. 
if you want to turn on the Wi-Fi, Bluetooth or mobile data etc you have to visit this settings every time because there is no shortcut on the home screen well i'm only talking about the cons of this OS, but there are a lot of pros like the phone storage of this device is extremely good and it is officially 8 gb the external sd card is expandable up to 64 gb which is also great for a device in this category you cannot customize the user interface that much but you can change the base color of tiles and you can also use this device as a wi-fi hotspot and Another very premium feature of this device is its NFC support and Lumia 520 doesn't have any NFC as you know. There is also a battery saving option which is also I'll say very very handy. You will see a heart sign on this battery whenever this battery saver is on and you can also check these three options here regarding the battery backup. I'm getting around 1.5 days with normal to heavy uses which I'll say very good. You are also getting this find my phone option which is also very handy when your phone is lost or stolen. Another great feature of this Lumia 620 is its Dolby headphone sound enhancement and also equalizer support. There are 19 preset equalizers and the headset on this device is not that much good considering the category and the quality of this device now the main feature of this device is obviously calling and the call quality on this device is extremely good there is a secondary microphone for noise cancellation and the ear speaker is also very loud and very clear typing on this 3.8 inches display is not an issue if you get used to this keyboard and Though there is no vibrating feedback or swipe input support on this keyboard, the typing experience is not bad and there is also Hindi and a lot of other Indian language support. Now let's talk about the best feature on this Windows Phone 8 operating system. Here is the People Hub which is also the contacts menu on this device. You are getting all of your friends from Facebook, Twitter etc. and you can write on their wall or know about their updates so you don't have to install any third party app you cannot find any other operating system that has such a nice social life integration you can also create groups of your friends or family members if you don't want to get updates of all of your friends so this windows phone os is just perfect for those people who spend a lot of time on social networking sites as this OS is directly from Microsoft, you are getting this PC-like experience of your office files. The best thing about a Nokia device is its Nokia Drive. It is a true offline turn-by-turn voice-guided navigation suite and the Nokia Maps is also very very good. You will get around 4000 Indian cities under this Nokia Maps and you can also access these maps without any internet connection if you download these maps. Now as you know there is no FM radio on this device but you have got this Nokia music. There are around 8 million songs on this Nokia music and you can download and hear songs for free and these songs are also royalty free so the songs you are downloading are not pirated there is also this mix radio option which is kind of like radio you will get these options and after that you will hear one song after another and these mixes are not made by this software these mixes are made by real people from the music industry you have to select the category as well Let's talk about the camera on this device. The camera is fairly decent for the category of this device. Under good lighting condition it is extremely good but indoor images look washed out and grainy. But that's normal because this is a mobile phone. This phone can capture HD videos at 30 fps and the video capability is also extremely good. Especially the microphone is just awesome. In fact all the Lumia devices captures a very good sound during videography and check the channel for the video sample. This phone also has a front facing VGA camera. You can also apply these lenses here and also download from the store. 
well friends we are at the final part of this in-depth review on this Lumia 620 and overall this is an extremely fast device if you compare it with similar devices from Android then this is way better for example this phone can handle full HD video playback whereas Galaxy S Duos which is priced at almost the same cannot even handle HD videos this phone can also handle HD games like Assassin's Creed or Asphalt 7 hit and regarding the look and the feel this phone does not has those creepy look of entry level devices and though it is kinda thick I like it because this is a very compact device the display size is only 3.8 inches so this bulky design actually helps this phone to fit into the palm very nicely for everyday normal uses this is just the perfect phone and above all we should not forget that this is a dual core device this phone sports 1 gigahertz dual core great processor along with 512 mb of ram and adreno 305 gpu so regarding the specifications this is the best device in the market now the question is the software windows phone 8 is obviously a great OS. the user interface is consistent throughout the OS and also the third party apps android ios etc especially android looks kinda messy sometimes and those OSs are all about applications widgets etc whereas windows phone 8 is all about integrity and consistency the social networking integration on this OS is the best you can get on any other OS. but there are a lot of shortcomings as well if you want to play with your phone a lot if you want to customize it then this windows phone 8 does not have that much to offer you there is no file manager support and the number of applications available for this OS is still very low but if you ignore this if you don't need these features then this lumia 620 is a great device to buy so that's all in this in-depth review you can check the channel for the reviews on Lumia 520 and also don't forget to subscribe to this channel that is Gadgets Portal and also visit my Facebook page facebook.com slash Gadgets Portal.